Plant-based foods and protein transition is important because in my role as Vice President within Profit International, I see opportunities. The European plant-based food sector grew by nearly 50% in 2020, and a Dutch survey showed that well over 70% of people believe we should eat fewer animal products. Flexitarianism is growing around the world. Between 20 and 50% of people don't eat meat every day and are choosing plant-based alternatives. This is a huge win-win. People eating healthier and plant-based foods and sustainable businesses are thriving, innovating and producing tasty, affordable and exciting plant-based products. We're currently experiencing the sixth mass extinction of species and biodiversity loss. We're facing dangerous climate change events and over 70 billion land animals and more than a trillion sea animals are killed for food each year. Animal agriculture is responsible for 20% of global greenhouse gas emissions and if we allow current consumption patterns to continue, we would be using up nearly the entire carbon budget left to stay within the 2 degree limit within the next 80 years. This is not sustainable. We must eat more plants, which also will be beneficial to public health. In my field as a food awareness organization with a mission to transforming the global food system, we need more research into consumer preferences and research into innovation of tasty, healthy and affordable plant-based products in order to accelerate to more plant-rich diets. People are interested in dairy alternatives, including cheese, yogurt, cream, ice cream and baked goods. We also need fantastic chicken and fish substitutes. We need funding to increase plant-based and fermented food products at scale, as well as increasing efficiency along the supply chain so that products become affordable. And we need funding for transitioning farmers to switch from animal-based farming to plant-based farming and to grow suitable crops. The European Commission can be supportive through increasing budgets for plant-based, fermented and cultured foods. The Horizon 2020 research areas need to include eligibility criteria to develop alternatives to processed meat, dairy, eggs and seafood products. Globally, over half a trillion US dollars have been spent on agriculture subsidies that undermine sustainability and nature-related goals. We therefore need to redirect EU funding to plant-based production methods in order to slow down the current severe environmental impacts and to seize opportunities.